Guys, today is Sunday and we are going to see some something downtown. We're just gonna go around the town. Uh, there's this other couch surfer, his name is Anderson, and he's gonna join us. We're at this park in uh, Porto Velo, which has a lot of historic meaning. Uh, I'm not gonna go into it, but I'll just show you what it's about. Uh, so now I'm with Anderson. Anderson yeah. is the other couch surfer, and his dad is over there too. Ah, yeah, and they're showing me around the city. So they're telling me that Americans were the ones who founded this city and when they founded this city they made these three water tanks right here. They founded the city because they made a railroad, a railroad between Bolivia and Brazil. And I don't know why they had to be Americans, I don't know if they were the only ones who could build it or something. So guys check it out, there's a protest going on against the World Cup, which I'm pretty sure I'm gonna see a couple of these. Check it out guys, this is the Madeiro, the Madeiro River? Madeira. 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 River. Wood. The Wood River. Biggest. So guys, this river is the second biggest river yes. by volume. Yeah, the third world. biggest in the world. And it's um, it's about a kilometer, I don't know if you guys can see, but this is the river that, that I crossed two days ago. Except that it's, it was, it's wider here. And this is the one that overflew, uh, overflooded the city a, a couple of weeks ago. So as you guys can see that line, that brown line right there, that's where the water level used to be when it was flooded. We were up there just a second ago. But this is where the town was started back in the day. And you see these train tracks? This is where the Americans were building the train. But not really the Americans, they just planned it. I'm sure they had a bunch of natives building it. So this building is now a museum. They were telling me that they made a museum out of it three years ago. And they rebuilt it and now we got all messed up with the flood. But you guys can see the line of the flood right here. Let's just see. We're not recording. Hmm? It's recording? Yeah. Hey guys, so we're going, we're going to church right now. In case it's not obvious. some pizza and this is like very Brazilian pizza because that right there is banana banana and meat and like onion. onion the green thing I don't know the name right, let's try it so guys that pizza was actually pretty good uh, probably the best pizza I've had outside of the US definitely it was really good and they had a banana pizza like I've never seen that banana pizza and they also had a chocolate pizza it was gum I couldn't show you guys we're coming to this park right here where um, as you guys can see it's full of people just eating drinking chilling there are some tents there where you can find typical foods from North Brazil so guys, these are crepes, Brazilian style. They put a stick in it. And over there they have hot dogs. But they're different because they have like special sauces for them. Holy crap, look at that. They put like a stuffing inside. That's, that looks so filling right there. Holy crap. That's the end result, guys. Mm -hmm. That's pastel. That's pastel right there. Different stuff in trees. This thing, uh, we call it uh, paloya. Yes, it's chocolate. It's a kind of, kind of cake. And cake, cake. And some shrimp. This is more food styles. Uh, we were on the other side of the street now. Here's another side that has more food. Yeah, 
Yeah, these people don't care if they get run over. And it's a Sunday and people are out partying. But I was just telling Amanda that I, I can already tell that these three months are gonna be fucking crazy. It's gonna be partying, partying, partying because of the World Cup, because all these people party all the time.